So yeah, so we have a lot of people that don't know how to you know put drum sets together. Yeah, actually we do. Yeah, lots, lots of parents, uh -huh. first time buyers. Uh -huh. I don't know, what do you think the number one question we have really is? Um, I think hi-hat clutches. Yeah, those can be a pain. Yeah, yeah, they can actually be a major pain. As yeah. small as they are, yeah. they're a big pain. Yeah. What's going to come up here next yes. is how to put together a clutch. A hi-hat clutch. Yeah, uh, how to put the hi-hats in the hi-hat stand using the clutch and make it work. So this is the hi-hat stand. Probably the most complicated piece of hardware that we deal with other than the bass drum pedal. It's usually composed of two pieces. Okay, We have our upper tube and we have our lower tube which is connected to our tripod and our pedal. Here we have the clutch which is really what our main focus of this video is but just to show you how the assembly goes together. So I'm going to take this clutch off Again, what we have is we have our pull rod, you can probably see right here, that it goes up and down, okay? So I'm going to take the upper tube off to expose the pull rod. And again, we can see the rod going up and down, okay? And I'm going to take off the upper rod, which is threaded into the lower rod, which in turn is connected to the pedal. So to assemble the rod, we just go in reverse order. Remember to assemble the hi-hat stand, we go in reverse order. We put the rod back on. Upper tube assembly on. Tighten that down. Put the clutch down. We'll also see you tighten that down that the clutch goes for the ride with the upper rod. So now when we put the hi-hats on, there's usually a bottom or a top, so we'll put the bottom one on this cup here. And you'll see that this one just sits. See the rod moves up and down and this just stays stationary. So what we have here is we have the, the clutch, which is essentially a long threaded bolt. We have two lock nuts right here that face each other, two felt washers that the symbol actually sits between, and at the bottom we have another nut that cinches everything down. So I'm going to take it apart. Now this bottom nut here will only go on in one direction, okay? You can't put it on the other way, so you're going to know which way to put that back together. Then you have your two felts, and all we're really going to do is we're going to just take one felt off because we want this on the other side of the symbol. We put the clutch into the hi-hat, we flip the hi-hat over, and we do everything in reverse. We put our felt washer back on, so now the two felt washers are sandwiching the hi-hat. We have our last nut that will only again thread in on one way. So you're going to put it on and thread it the whole way until it actually stops. It will stop and that's when you're done. Now, if you want your cymbal to be tighter or looser for different styles of playing and different feels, we can adjust this lock nut right here.